one day he comes to me and he's like, so I obviously really like Rose and I, I think she likes me. And he's like, what do you, what do you think I should do? Should I go talk to her? Should I like, should I ask her out? The very next day he comes to me and he's like, so I kind of talked to her. So excited for you guys that you're finally past the stage of the extensive time change, all the voice messages and the literally never ending FaceTime that went on. We made it, living 4,075 miles apart. And here we are, 526 days later, ready to say I do in front of our family and friends. I promise to be with you in the good times and comfort you in the bad. Today, as my role changes from fiance to wife, I pray that we would be marked with a deep friendship and peace, and that people would come to know Jesus' sacrificial love through the way we serve and forgive each other every single day. As your husband, I promise to be by your side for the rest of your life, to be your main support buddy, cheering you on in whatever you're working towards, to laugh with you, probably often at mildly inappropriate times, <laughs> celebrating our good times together and giving you a shoulder to cry on in the hard times, to always strive to find better ways to know you and love you. No matter what we go through in life, I'll be by your side.
quite young. And we were talking about people getting married. And she looked up at her mom so sweetly and said, Mom, if I ever get married, I'm still going to live at home with you and Dad. So. <laughs> There's a lot of determination in Micah. I can say that determination. <clears throat> that determination has been channeled towards God. <clears throat>